After absorbing Nobatia, Makuria became the predominant power in the region. However, a new faith was about to be born across the Red Sea. The teachings of Prophet Muhammad was unfolded across Arabia, and this was the dawn of Islamic era. Immediately afterwards, the Rashidun Caliphate stormed out of its homeland, as some of its homeland, as some of the most efficient conquerors in world history. By 641, the armies of the Caliph Umar had seized Egypt, cutting Nubia from the rest of Christianity. Knowing the Nubians to be a dangerous power to leave unchecked, the Rashiduns immediately attacked the ancient land of Kush. This led to the first battle of Dongola. Dinko Farine. Salam, 
The Arab general Uqba ibn Nafi led a column of 20,000 horsemen into Makuria. The Arabs saw some initial successes until they proceeded towards the capital city of Dongla. The Muslims had vanquished the mighty Sassanid Persians and even brought the Romans to heel, so it seemed that the Nubians were no match for the Rashidun Caliphate. At the first battle of Dongla, the deadly aim of 10,000 Nubian marksmen was able to inflict between 10,000 to 15,000 deaths on the unsuspecting Arab horsemen. Ibn Nafi's army was decimated and the Arabs were forced to retreat.